I'm Joey Greco, and welcome to this riveting installment of Cheers. Josh Hader is a desperate man haunted by his wife's recent remoteness. To keep his family together, Josh petitions cheaters to take a closer look at his marriage. Josh Hader, age 27. A restaurant manager worried that his wife's recent unavailability may be indicative of a personnel change. Got pregnant very early in our relationship. And it, it was a shock to me, but I didn't care. This was the woman that, that I, 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 I'm spending the rest of my life with. I love her. I love to be around her. I love everything about her. Things changed. As the pregnancy went along, things changed, and she got very defensive and aggressive with me. Started becoming very private. Around the same time that she started acting differently, she started getting a lot of cell phone calls all hours of the day. She would either leave the room to go answer it, or she would just ignore the call and just say, oh, it's a, it's the wrong number, or it's a 1-800 number. That, I, I just don't understand a, a telemarketer calling at 6 a.m. or 5 a.m., 4 a.m. And they would call all the time. And every time I would ask about her, it would always go back to a fight. One particular time, she stormed out of the house after a stupid argument, left the baby with me. And about an hour later, I heard her cell phone ringing in the bedroom. She left it behind. And I went in there, and it was a private number. And as soon as I answered it, they hung up. About 30 minutes later, they called back again. I answered it. They hung up. It's just kind of odd to me that she leaves all the time. Her phone rings all the time. Uh, she says she loves me, but I just don't know. It's killing me. It's killing me that I don't have her around. It's killing me that the baby doesn't have her around. I just love her, and I hope she's not doing anything wrong. Suspect's identity withheld. Age 24, a housewife accused of neglecting her family as well as her fidelity. Investigation day two. After getting briefed on the suspect's alleged trip out of town, cheaters' detectives are dispatched. Agents set up a perimeter around the Hader residence. A few hours into their shift, PIs catch a glimpse of the suspect, whose identity remains withheld, as she exits the house with baby and bags in hand. Mrs. Hader loads up the car and heads out. An hour's drive away, the suspect arrives at an unfamiliar residence. As the suspect pulls up, detectives notice an unknown male approaching the car. Josh's wife, his daughter, and the mysterious companion proceed inside. Later, the threesome emerge and drive off. After a brief pursuit, they arrive at a nearby restaurant and stroll inside. The suspect and her companion enjoy a pleasant meal while the baby sleeps. Once the meal is finished, they return to the companion's place of residence and disappear inside. With the baby down for the night, Mrs. Hader and her companion adjourn to the patio for some quality time. Sitting on the stoop, the couple cuddle together for a while before returning inside where they remain for the rest of the night. Investigation Day 3. Detectives on stakeout in front of the residence catch the companion, Russ Wilson, exiting the domicile, carrying baby Jamie. With Mrs. Hader right behind, the quasi-family travels to a nearby park for a day of fun in the sun. They saunter around the park and stop by the swing set. Wilson gently pushes Mrs. Hader and her child before they pause to share a kiss. Once they get their fill of inertia-based fun, they set out for the suspect's car. They drive a few miles away to a video store to pick out the evening's entertainment. They peruse the aisles and finally find a winner before journeying to a liquor store to pick up some libations. Returning to Wilson's residence, the couple sit on the stoop, admiring the beautiful baby for a while. The admiration soon turns to each other as the couple kiss like long-lost loves. After a modest make-out session, the pair gather up the baby and her belongings before proceeding inside for the night. Investigation Day 4. Stationed outside the Wilson residence, P.I.s spot an unfamiliar car approaching. An unknown female exits and is invited inside. A few minutes later, Wilson and his married mistress emerge and take off for a night on the town, untethered to a child. 
With exhaustive man hours dedicated to the case, investigators have now discovered the missing piece to this illicit puzzle. The suspect and Wilson were once an item, having dated for several years, breaking up only months before the suspect became Mrs. Josh Hader. The couple turn up at a local pub and head inside, arm in arm, excited to cut loose. Mrs. Hader feeds her loving hubby Josh a bunch of bologna in this recorded phone call. With a mountain of evidence proving Mrs. Hader's misconduct, Cheater's PIs head back to headquarters to compile the footage. Coming up, the confrontation. With the suspect's dishonesty well documented, Cheaters meets Josh to discuss the findings. Putting aside his distress, Josh readies himself for the horrific reality. Josh, thanks for coming into Dallas to meet with us tonight. Our detectives have some information that they thought it would be important for me to say. Are you ready to look at that now? Yes. Josh, we began our investigation the evening that left on her trip. A detective was stationed outside your house. At this time, we saw her. She loaded the car up, has Jamie with her, and she hits the road. Our detectives followed her. She arrived at a location. A gentleman exits, helps her bring some things inside. They're there for a short period of time before we see both of them exit. They get in the car and were followed until they arrived at a restaurant. They sit down, grab something to eat, after which time they return back to the residence. And not long after that, we see them both sit down, grab a seat outside. That looks like her ex-boyfriend. I've seen pictures before. Well, they sit on the stoop, and after a relaxing conversation outside, they go into the home, and that's where she ended up spending the evening. I was right all along. I no. No. Does anybody have a cigarette? I need a cigarette, please. more information if you want to see it. Does it get any worse than that? I think he should be the judge of that. Let's see it. I want, all, I want everything. On the next evening, our detective observed another car arriving. An individual exits, goes into the house. Shortly thereafter, this gentleman and exit. They're dressed evidently to go out for the evening, spend some time at a local bar, and at the end of the evening, it appears they may have been overserved. They head back to the car, make their way back to this residence, stumble back inside, and that's where they remained for the rest of that evening. They dropped off Jamie at another location, went out to have dinner. They had some drinks. They're back at the house now. I think the best thing to do is just is get there as quickly as we can before they go to bed. They're still up now, lights are still on. But for now, let's try and get there as quickly as we can, okay? okay. All right, come with me. Everybody out, everybody out. Let it out, let it out. All right. Wait, we just hey, hey, hang on. Whoa, whoa. 
Hey! Hey! What the whoa, whoa, What the whoa, whoa. What the whoa, whoa. Get the outside now! Dude, what the hell? Get the hey. off me, man! Get the off me, dog! What the Get in there! Get in there! Break it up, guys! Break it up! What the? Josh. What the? Thought you were broken off. Where's my baby at? Oh, oh where's my baby at? Coming up, the conclusion. Where the? Yeah. Where's my baby at? Where the? the my kid. Where the, my kid at? I know it's your kid. What? I know it's your kid. That's my kid, man. That's my kid. Off me. What the? No, stop it! Stop it! Josh, Josh! Break it up. Josh, Josh! Josh! Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Stop I'm that. Sorry no. for what? Baby, I don't know. You take Baby. your ring, you shove it up your ass. Man? Where the my daughter at? Where the my kid? I want my baby now. Baby, I need to talk no, I want my baby now. Where the f is she at? Baby. Where the f is my baby at? Stop it, stop it, honey. Get honey, off honey, of me. Please. Where the f is you know, my kid? Okay, baby, it's, it might not be yours, okay? It what? Might. It's my kid, bro. What What? What the f is my baby? What? 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 Everybody out. Dude. We're gonna get everybody out. Oh, yeah, my I'll house, leave. Man. All right, we're gonna get everybody out. I'll leave. Watch out, watch out. Oh, no. Come on, guys, bitch. Oh, no. You, man. I'm taking all my bitch, man. You, man. Why is he just going? Come on, kid. Watch out. He's a punk ass bitch. Watch out. Gotta bring the whole crew. 